so this is Jojo and she's showing us um, her little camping setup. This is so awesome. It's a little minivan, right? What? It's a Chrysler Town and Country. Uh huh. A minivan. Um, so literally, I just woke up and uh, <laughs> this is a mess. So you're seeing how it really is. See, I just pulled into her bedroom and I'm like, oh, can I videotape you? <laughs> That's great. And you just made that little platform you said? Yeah. So um, That's awesome. This is 48 by 48, but surprisingly, because I'm only 5'4", uh -huh. I can sleep diagonally because that's nice. a much larger distance. Yeah. Um, yeah, so I'm going to show you the platform. Uh -huh. Things are going to fall. So I'm just going to move this stuff. And you said though that those mats are professionally made? Yeah, I went to a uh, local upholster. Uh -huh. And um, I sh they, they saw the van and they made them for me. Oh, how neat. Only because I was out of time. I could have bought foam and uh -huh. taken this material and put it on top. Yeah, but... So they cut it um, yeah, they're pretty 24, well done. Yeah. 24, and then there's one long piece that's 48. Nice, yeah. nice, perfect. And then these two pieces, um, since I made oh, this and I'm uh -huh. not a professional, let me just move this. I just left them loose. I actually got some help for, from um, the solo uh, female van group on uh -huh. Facebook. And I was telling them I'm having a problem because these aren't laying flat. So they just told me just leave them loose. Don't nail them uh -huh. in. So I did that. Well, that's so, that's very smart. It, it kind of makes everything oh, convenient. So now, That's very convenient. This is my basement. <laughs> like literally I'm throwing everything down there that's just in the way. That's great. Because I brought a lot of stuff. Like this is a brand new bed set from Target, but uh -huh. I don't have use for it. You know, it's just too uh -huh. much. And then that's a toilet underneath. And I just have like laundry and just things that I don't want to see yeah. in my basement. But yeah. on my next trip, I'm going to be a little more organized. So yep. this is 20 inches, this board, and this is 28 inches. So how many trips do you have you taken in this? With this setup, this is the first one. Oh, very cool, yeah, so very this cool. this is our maiden voyage. I love it. Yeah, so this is pretty comfortable. I, I was going to bring my REI sleeping pad, but uh -huh. this is really firm. I think that's a little more comfortable yeah. than an REI sleeping yeah. pad. Yeah. And it kind of lets me toss and turn a little bit. Uh -huh. So. And you've got an REI bag, so you're set. Yeah. I'm an yeah. REI fanatic. I, I have spent many, many dollars at REI for sure. Very neat. And then you still have all that room in there. Yes, yeah, um, so I have, um, yeah, pretty much this is the room that the seats would have taken. Yeah. And so you've got everything you need in your bins. Mm -hmm. And then what's that over there? Those are my FIDS. Your FIDS? <laughs> yeah, F-I-D-S, which stands uh -huh. for Feathered Kids. Oh! Yeah. Really? Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm intrigued. Okay. So they're about, it's time for them to wake up on uh -huh. as well. So those two bins I got from the container store. Yeah. And they're about less than eight inches tall. So if I wanted to, I could actually lay them down flat and uh -huh. extend my bed because it comes up to the right height of my bed. Yeah. But I don't need to because I'm short enough where I can just stay on here. Nice. Um, yeah, so all of this stuff has cubbies. Nothing is organized. I plan to uh -huh. do a tour after my next trip. Yeah. I think I'll, I'm learning a lot here. Uh huh. You know, what I need. Yeah, absolutely. And something else I want to do is I want to build a cabinet here. Um, so I'm going to sacrifice probably this cushion and work with the carpenter to build uh -huh. a, a little cabinet. And then you would sleep just diagonally and yeah, that cause would right be. Right now I sleep with my head there. Yeah. And my feet come here. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay, so yeah. you, yes, you utilize all the space. Yeah, absolutely. So if you want, I can show you the. the words. Would you please? So, yeah, so, okay, um, great. I love it. Before that, I'll show you my kitchen setup. So it's very basic. Uh huh. So this is like my dishes. Um, I think I have coffee. I have a few pots in there, uh -huh. and then this is kind of a pantry. So I have oatmeal and just little items that uh -huh. I can um, make. And this is my stove. Nice. It's an alcohol stove. So oh, it's, neat. Um, I just filled it yesterday. So you just have to put it on zero and then push. And this is full of alcohol. Nice. So theoretically, if we wanted heat, I could turn it on. Yeah. And it won't, you know, If you kill needed us. to. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I love it. Right. So for the birds, and I keep this area sterile, so I don't, like, come back here with shoes or anything. Uh-huh. So I'll just show you how I come back here. Oh my goodness, I love that. That's just like a plastic rubber mat. Yes. I love it. This I got from Lowe's. I bought five feet, uh -huh. um, two two pieces, but five feet each, and then it goes like deep in, under the seats, yeah. and then it goes under the bed. So, yeah, with birds, and even with myself, I'm pretty messy. I can just uh -huh. spray the floor with alcohol, and yeah. then just 
wipe it out of the van. Nice. Which I like, yeah. But I don't like anything back there. So my method is I take my shoes off and then... She's bendy. Yeah, you gotta be a little bendy. <laughs> you gotta be a little bendy. I flip back. I can fit through these, um, uh -huh. luckily. And then I come back here and I just sit on the bed. It's cool. Really good headroom. Yeah, it so is. So I specifically made this um, only high enough so I could have Lower. tons of room to just sit. That's brilliant. Box. Brilliant. So we're dealing with the birds. Like the cage is a mess right now, so Lola's okay. caught me. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> right in the morning. Um, but this is our routine. It's, it's a bit of work when you have birds. Uh huh. So I pretty much take as much as I can and put it on the bed. This stuff is normally not here. It uh -huh. should be under the bed platform. It's hard to stay organized in a small space, isn't it? Not so much. Yeah, for it is for <laughs> yeah, me. There's, there's people who are really organized and uh -huh. just trash. There was a bug in my van yesterday, so. <laughs> All right, so yesterday was cold. I'm uh -huh. sure you can attest to that. Yeah. And we'd have heat, so I bought this um, REI blanket. Uh -huh. So it's kind of a, it's got synthetic material in it. Yeah. Um, so it should keep them warm. It should act like a sleeping bag. Uh -huh. They they don't have degrees on there, so I don't know what the degree count is. Yeah. So but that's yeah. the top layer. Uh huh. And yesterday was the first time we used it, so it's a uh, the REI brand. Yeah. Which I love their brand. And then this is an emergency blanket, which I cut into two pieces. Uh huh. So they are actually wrapped from the bottom. Very good, smart. All the way around. Um, and this is the most powerful material that uh -huh. I have for them. Because they're, they're producing heat. I mean, even though it's cold, uh -huh. the three of them sitting together, they're creating heat and it's reflecting off the blanket. Gotcha. And then this is actually, um, doesn't provide really a lot of value, but it's... <laughs> Max is uh, the one screaming and he has a stranger danger, so you may want to beep out his screams. Okay. Um, but this is just to keep them from biting the actual uh, metallic material because uh -huh. they do tend to bite just yeah you know, out of because um, that's what they, what like they do. do yeah so I'm oh not gonna actually goodness. remove all of this um, okay and this is the morning so it's a mess uh, I normally clean their cages in the in the morning uh huh so oh, right now this is you like pretty guys hi this is Max he's the screamer he's a Hans Macaw uh -huh. and awesome. that is Stevie he's an Amazon you guys are awesome. See, Vicky doesn't have anything on you guys with her cat. <laughs> this is great. And they're eating their breakfast. And they're, uh -huh. they're actually out of food, so... You want to come? And Minnie's in the back. She's a little more timid uh -huh. than the others with new people. That's great. How long have you had them? I've had them since 2011, so it'll be nine years. Oh, wow. Yeah. Hi. Yeah, it's, this is Lola. You've seen her videos. <laughs> <laughs> are you guys subscribed to my channel? They, we are. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they actually watch a lot of these of these YouTube videos. Oh, that's so me. great. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness! Well, thank you so much You're for welcome. showing me your digs. You're I welcome. love it. And for curtains, I just use uh -huh. uh, black nylon lip stop. Yeah. Because it prevents um, you know condensation or growth or anything like that, and it works Brilliant. great. Yeah. Even though you can see through it. When I pull this um, curtain, uh -huh. even during the day, no one can see through the van. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah, so it really works. I love it. So I use it for all the windows, even the uh -huh. back. Yeah. I see you doing very great things in here. Yeah. Oh, how fun. Fun, yeah. fun, fun. Yeah, that's great. We're working on our next van. Yeah. Uh, we don't know if it's going to be a van trailer combo. Uh huh. But this definitely helps us figure things out. Definitely. Yeah. Hey, if you can make it work in this, I bet it gets great gas mileage. Yeah. 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 With the seats gone, uh -huh. I went from getting the, at best 21 miles per gallon yeah. now to 29. Wow. Yeah. That's great. So these seats are heavy. Yeah. And there's still two more that uh -huh. I'm looking to remove. Right. Yeah. Right. Awesome. Yeah. Well, I guess I'm going to go down there and see what's going on with the Billy Strong group okay. down there Thanks doing their Dutch oven. But thank you so much. <laughs> You're welcome. All right. We'll see you on the tubes. Okay. Bye. <laughs> Bye.